So, I'm on here at Highway 1604 in North San Antonio. So, I'm on here at Highway 1604 in North San Antonio uh, on the way to the campground. I'm still about maybe 80, 90 miles away. Be uh, beautiful morning, very windy. Uh, I'm going to Bandera Road, exit number, or highway number 16, then long going through mountains and hills and valleys. So I'll start recording here in a little while. I'm now driving through the town of Halotus, Texas. This is the end of the city area. Finally going in the country after driving 49 miles from my house. <laughs> and uh, wish myself good luck. I'm getting hungry. <laughs> Someone's trying to distract me. So this here is the little town of Bandera, Texas. It's a little more than two thirds of the way to Las Maples. Stuck at the light here. But this is a touristy area. To my other side, there's an antique shop. This is doing 360 recording, so I'm not sure if it's exactly getting everything. A lot of barbecue places here. I see a cowboy store, probably hats or whatever. So if I were to go this way, it's that old campground or walking area called Hill Country State Natural Area. But to this direction is Las Maples. So I'm gonna find a little gas station, pull over, get some snacks, I guess, or a snack, coffee, bathroom, then go to Los Maples. Stop recording. Just wanted to catch some of this beautiful area here. That's the beginning of the hills. I don't know if you can see on the recording, but there's some beautiful houses up there. Lucky people. And the road is starting uh, winding around. So we'll stop recording for now. So, about 10 miles outside of Bandera. This is Route 16, going northwest toward Medina. Probably about another 45, 50 miles to the campground. Just past the exit to Tarpley is where Cornerstone Christian Church Retreat is at. This area is very beautiful. The mountains start up probably about 15 miles again. Well, hills compared to some of the places I've just been. This road is very windy, a lot of deer. You gotta be careful you don't hit the deer. Oh, some hills are starting up right now. Someone pulling a really nice RV. Like I said, getting close to Medina. Perfect day out here, about 71 degrees. Yesterday it was like 90 something up here. It's a much better day for hiking. And we'll stop for now. Stop recording.
going up into a rather hilly area here. Trying to position the camera. I can feel the higher elevation. I can feel my ears popping. To my left, there's a big ranch down there in that small valley. through a little, almost like canyon area. They pretty much had to blow out the mountain here with dynamite to make this road going straight up. Rocks on either side. Looks like it's gonna go up again at the top of this other hill. Scenic overlook area. see what's at the top of this hill. Pretty much at the top of all the hills right now. Recording stop. Stop recording. another rocky area. Very beautiful. There was a sign warning about falling rocks because that can happen around here. And we're going back up again. Getting close to Vanderpool. spectacular view over here. Ears are popping, coming down out of the mountain area. Approaching Vanderpool a little bit here. But you can see that mountain up there with roads going to the top. It's absolutely beautiful. something called Mill Creek. <laughs> it's dried out. Stop recording.
this is the day use picnic area. And there's an area down here that's kind of like a loop around where you park, where you enter the trail. You can see some rather large hills over there. starting the trail. Using a smaller selfie stick. Very beautiful area. Looks like I'll be coming out of the shade here soon. This thing's already down to half battery, so I may be switching to the other battery soon. And going up a little bit of stairs. Bike access one mile only. I haven't quite figured out how to get the me mode working. Stop recording. So this is starting up the maple trail. And these shoes are a lot better for these rocks, I notice. Supposedly this trail will expose me to a lot more beautiful maples. There are a lot of rocks to watch. Speaking of rocks. Wow, look at this. This is worth getting out the other camera for. Stop recording. Just got done with the maple trail. Rediscovered this little area. Just a little area where there's water. In previous years, there was a lot more water. I was here 10 years ago. It's like a little offshoot of the Salmon River, the size of that rock. Beautiful. Let's get a little fake drone shot here. I'm not even using my mega selfie stick, just the smaller one. These here are cedar trees. These are the things when the wind blows through here in the winter. Island goes all the way to San Antonio and makes everybody sneeze, including me. Continuing the trail. So about a mile and a half down this trail, just past the Maple Trail. Getting kind of bright and hot out here. Finally, some shaded area. Like I said, these boots are really helping me. 
before I'm just going here in high top gym shoes or regular feet were getting all beat up. More cedar trees, mesquite, dead. <laughs> Stop recording. Okay, I'm gonna do another recording. When this thing booted up last time, it sounded weird, like the sound was distorted, not responding to command, so let's try this again for a little bit. Maybe it's getting low on battery. About a mile and a half, maybe a mile and three quarters down the trail. Stop recording. So this is the huge selfie stick I'm using. This area is called the grotto. The selfie stick goes halfway up the grotto. This is the seven foot selfie stick. If you add my height to it, it's probably up about 13 feet. Not much water in there. Just a trickle. Bring the selfie stick down two feet. Stop recording. Stop recording.